Good afternoon, everybody. In close coordination with Ukraine, has made the decision to provide the M1A1 variant of the Abrams tank, which will enable us to significantly expedite delivery timelines and deliver this important capability to Ukraine by the fall of this year. It will also give Ukraine a very similar capability to the M1A2, which includes advanced armor and weapon systems to include a 120 millimeter cannon and 50 caliber heavy machine gun. So we never got into the, the specifics uh, other than to say we were projecting uh, it would be probably over a year uh, or so before we would have been able to deliver that, that A2 variant. And so, uh, again, this approach will allow us to get that combat capability them quicker. So my understanding, Tony, is that these will be uh, excess hulls in our inventory that we will refurbish, refit uh, through a combination of USAI and security assistance packages uh, in order to make them uh, combat ready. So, so really, what you know, to put that into context, what, what we were talking about at the time was whether or not we had M1A1s that were going to roll off, the, or you know, M1s in general are going to roll off the line ready to go forward. So we're, we're talking about a different thing here, right? We're talking about refitting, refurbishing uh, these hulls to make them ready on a quicker timeline for Ukraine.